Hey everyone, it's Ed Graney from the Review Journal. Listen, I'm in Miami, Florida to cover Sunday Super Bowl between Kansas City and San Francisco. The reason we're down here tonight, I'm with our great videographer Heidi Fang, is we wanted to know about Miami and the state of Florida if they become a little flat hat hosting Super Bowls. This is their 11th. Do they still get excited about it? Are they still jacked up to bring the entire world here to Florida? Well, there's no better place to find out between locals and tourists what the case is when it comes to wanting a Super Bowl. Because I'm telling you, in 2025, Las Vegas is probably going to get one. But for now, let's go talk to people on the iconic place that is South Beach. Do you get the sense the Super Bowl is here, or is this just any other night in South Beach? Well, for me, I haven't been here for about, last time I was here was about five years, okay. five years ago. So it's more festive because the Super Bowl here, but I really couldn't tell when I came in today yeah. that it was a Super Bowl here this year. You couldn't tell. This is so spread out. Unless you see signage, I don't even know if you think you're at one. True? No, you really don't, right, babe? Do you feel like yeah, you're uh, you, you, you like honestly? You see everything here controlled, like Super Bowl, Super Bowl, Super Bowl. But when you go outside the skirts, you don't feel like it. But if you brought it to Chicago, if you brought it to Chicago, I swear to you, from the time that you arrive to It'll wherever like you're Bowl. going, it's gonna feel like Super Bowl. But think about it: the best games if you ever watched were the Packers. Or, or New Yorkers or anybody in that cold snow weather just hitting each other hard with the fumbles, right? Bring it to Chicago because that way we have the cold and you might you never know, you might get a Zortex where it's negative 50 and if you hit them, their teeth might fall out. I was intrigued when the Super Bowl came to the Northeast. It was different, you know, even though it was snowing that day, but it made it a little better because we always come to a warm climate to have the Super Bowl. So I think Roger Goodell need to switch it up sometime and go back to the Northeast and play in cold climates just to give it a different different feel. Usually when you're at a Super Bowl, you see jerseys, you see hats, you see everything. I'm not seeing that here. Right. And I, I agree with you wholeheartedly. It's like it just seemed like another day. Um, I was at some of the local eateries, I'll say, and it, you just couldn't tell. Everybody was just having, enjoy, having a good time and just enjoying itself. You heard no conversation in regards to football. There's always ups and downs, you know. You know, there's seasons, and you know the, you know that we, we, it's not the Super Bowl yet, of course not. But uh, you would, there's there's been changes for the uh, the last few years, you know. I mean, definitely. I mean, uh, I mean the city has made a lot of changes, you know, uh, with the restaurants and. You know, and that uh, definitely, you know, didn't help. You know, we can have the music very loud, this, that, the music can be, you know, uh, trespass the, the, the street. Uh, you know, but I don't know exactly why, you know, maybe, you know, there's all the challenges, all the places, you know, that are, you know, better, more affordable, better quality, or who knows exactly what's the reason. If you're walking down the street right now, do you know you're at the Super Bowl? No. It doesn't feel like, not not now, we'll see what's going on on Sunday. What are the odds we want to bring it to Vegas? I'm sure it's going to, I think it's going to happen next See, Marcia, Marcia's a Vegas, she's, she's for I Vegas. I think it's going to happen. Yeah. I think it's going to happen. It's because Vegas gets everything, you know they that, do. babe. They Vegas is, gets everything that they want. Oh, it would be crazy, right? <laughs> I haven't been in, in for Super Bowl in Vegas, but, but I can only imagine. Well, neither has Vegas, but if they ever get one, what yeah, do you think? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It's just party over there. I think it would do well because that town, you know, it's a gambling town, and I think people would be more intrigued with the game and the spreads and everything like that. So here it's like it's laid back. Everybody's having fun regardless if there's a Super Bowl here or not. Let's go, Niners! Let's go! Let's go, Niners! Let's go, Niners!